Hello and welcome to your daily video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you enjoyed today's reading. I upload a new video every single day at 6am Brisbane time. If you'd like to be notified of your daily guidance on different aspects of life, you can always click the notification bell and choose all. That way you won't miss an upload. In today's reading, we're going to be looking into, will this turn into love? All right, let's go ahead and have a look at, will this turn into love between you and someone special? Will this turn into love? Will this turn into love? Let's have a look. Will this turn into love? All right, what have we got? We have someone could be standing their ground around you, or this may be you. This is all about the energy of somebody not taking no for an answer in regards to something, okay? Something that there's adamant about. Now let's have a look at what this, what this is about. We have change with the wheel of fortune some kind of change needs to happen someone is standing their ground saying no we need to change the wheel of fortune is ruled by the four fixed signs aquarius scorpio leo and taurus the four fixed signs they kind of like things how they are and they don't really want to change they like to stay um very stable okay security is their biggest um most important thing in life now not saying that not everyone needs security but for the four fixed signs it's a bit of an obsession now with the wheel of fortune it means the change is coming regardless it's going to happen and someone could be standing their ground saying no i don't want this to happen or they might be saying no i want this to happen anyway we'll have a look at what the next card is it's about 10 of pentacles which is a really good change we really want the 10 of pentacles because that is very long-term stability okay now ten of pentacles is also about money that's coming in this is something you've earned over a long period of time this may have been accumulating over years ten of pentacles assures you of long-term stability for a long time okay whatever this ten of pentacles is it may be an inheritance it may be superannuation it may be savings over a long period of time like a nest egg it could even be uh, like a long service leave when you get paid okay so this is money coming in okay something that's going to help you for the long term now changes are coming towards that which is great Let's keep going. Next up, we have a decision that needs to be made. This Ten of Pentacles poses a important decision. Two of Swords is very much the card of um, logic as well as intuition and using our inner self in order to navigate this decision. Whatever this is that we need to decide, we need to do it using our our good senses okay this is libra and the moon moon is our intuition and libra is very fair okay according to the major arcana libra is ruled by justice and justice is very fair it is uh, always balancing the pros and cons to things now let's keep going and see what else we have judgment okay this is making a decision based on past experiences judgment is the past returning to us sometimes judgment indicates a cancer sign around you judgment is all about something returning from the past in order for us to make a decision in regards to some changes that we need to make 
the hangman. The hangman is Pisces energy. The hangman is also very much about something not moving forward. Okay, taking some time out to see something from a different perspective in regards to the hangman and judgment. Now, the Wheel of Fortune is over there indicating changes have taken place and they're coming in with really positive things. However, we're still faced with a decision, possibly someone coming back from the past. In some cases, this could be someone returning to you because judgment is all about resurrecting the past now uh, could be a Pisces could be a cancer sign could have been one of the four fixed signs this is all about change something long term okay maybe from a long time ago okay now um, two of swords is a decision uh, in regards to past experiences the hangman it's kind of a stagnant energy, unable to move forward because we need to make this decision. Now, um, see how he's kind of got chains on this wheel here. That is actually the wheel of fortune that he's kind of chained to. Remember what I said about the four fixed signs? They like things how they are. Now, the hangman being Pisces is actually a mutable sign indicating that the hangman is the key and the catalyst to create change. They activate changes. So this hangman is looking for a different perspective in order to get the Wheel of Fortune moving again. Next up, I was actually going to say, I wouldn't be surprised if the World card comes out, and there it is. The World card is wonderful. It means that we're leveling up. We're going up a level in life or in some aspect of our life. Notice how the, how the Hangman and the World card are actually looking at each other. The Hangman is actually looking at the World, saying, I need to get a catalyst moving forward because something needs to go up a level okay we need to move forward and we need to evolve on some level we've learned a lot from our past we need to make the decision to move forward in something okay this could be a certification okay graduation this could be uh changing our role at work uh as in an upgrade like being promoted to something Next up, we have the lovers. Now, with the world and the lovers, this could be a long-term, oh, sorry, a long-distance love. Well, with the Ten of Pentacles, it could be a long-term love, a love from the past, okay? It could be a Gemini. Now, the lovers is all about making a decision in regards to love. Now, the world card, like I said, is going up a level, okay? Perhaps things have been a bit stagnant with this love, okay? Okay? And something from the past has become stagnant. So now we're going up a level in regards to love. Perhaps if you've been dating, it's time to become exclusive. If you've been seeing each other exclusively for a while, it could be time to go the next level. Okay, so lovers and the world is all about that. It could also be, like I said, a long distance love. Page of Pentacles is wonderful next to the lovers because Page of Pentacles is telling me that we're actually grounding this energy. We're making it real. Okay, we're making it something that is going to last because the pentacle is something that's very grounded. It's like planting a seed, and that seed is going to grow into something very 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 beautiful and long term so long as the empress is close by which means that this is actually going to be nurtured uh, till it's fully grown into something beautiful and mature like growing old together the page of pentacles in love is uh, very nice it's a ring a necklace it's a promise of longevity it's grounding the love energy Okay, with the lovers card, pages bring winds of change in uh, when a message comes in. One of you may be saying something to the other that's going to ground your love. 
okay for the long term next up we have a celebration with nine of cups this is cheers to that saying this is great uh, the universe is really happy with the progress of this situation you're moving forward everything is happy at this time it's a personal goal achieved because it's kind of an individual card it's like I finally made it and I feel really good about myself Next up, we have the Emperor. I feel very in control of this. This is an Aries energy, maybe an Aries around you, or this could be you. Okay, the Emperor is I'm in control. I've got responsibilities here. This could also indicate an external energy, much like a father, a grandfather, uh, a, a boss energy, someone who is in charge, a lot of responsibilities here. Yeah. This could be you taking control of a situation. Uh, five of Swords is the energy of being victimized with the Emperor and the Five of Swords. We may be feeling that we've got a boss that's not treating us correctly in some cases or we feel that there is someone that is controlling us and they are um, not treating us very fairly. With a devil card, this is an over-controlling boss energy or someone who is overly controlling and abusing their control. Uh, with the death card, that's probably pretty good indicating that this situation is going to end soon. If you've got a controlling boss or a controlling person in your life, okay, this situation is going to end. All right, you can expect this situation to um complete itself it's just going to self-destruct and go away uh, with the death card death is Scorpio the devil is Capricorn all right so let's go ahead and look at the Lenormand and see what else we've got I hope you're having a wonderful weekend so far spirit tell me about will this turn into love uh, I think it will with the lovers and grounding the love and accolades with the nine of cups we've got the lilies healing uh, the lilies is a long-term card could be healing the past okay healing at the past moving into the future for some of you the um, lilies are also very much possibly the masculine is a bit older in some cases because this is also uh, the energy of age and it's um, a kind of an, a masculine card as well because it's um, indicating that there's a lot of attraction here specifically on the masculine side sometimes uh, but more so this is all about healing now we have the fox the fox could be a boss energy and you've got the emperor much like the fox also somebody may be looking um, for something here maybe looking for healing okay someone may be doing a bit of a search because the fox is very uh, wily and very clever and knows how to find things this per this person around you or this could be you is looking for healing possibly from the past probably long term also could be looking for uh, some intimacy in some cases now we've got the key which is an important opportunity now uh, the key is very much a card of significant doors being opened in life the key is opening doorways okay this could be to do with work some of you may be working in the healthcare industry because lilies have ties to health as well let's get the finder sequel keeper spirit tell me more about this yeah, for some of you looking at the love situation will this turn into love a significant opportunity with the person that's looking for uh, an intimate relationship for some of you or for um, healing the past yeah, for some others of you because you also got the judgment there 
Tell me more about this. Will this turn into love? We have wealthy man, okay? Wealthy man in a love reading is the ideal masculine partner, okay? The ideal. Next up we have is thinking about. The ideal is thinking about something that they're concerned about. Isn't that interesting? 3333. Three, three, three. Can you see that? How interesting is that? How the cards correspond there? Concerned about something. Um, the masculine energy is concerned about something. Let's get some more cards about work, perhaps, um, or the lovers. And um, how are we going to work something out? Okay, this is about work and lovers. Could be a workplace romance for some of you. I'll get one more card. Uh, and there's high honor, which means uh, a lot of respect. Okay, this masculine energy is thinking about with concern work with the lovers and because there's a lot of regard for this love situation okay so we might be worried about something and we know that we need to work on it and because there's a lot of regard for this love situation there's a lot of respect and a lot of regard for it we really want this to work out in other words in uh, another meaning for this is that uh, this masculine wants to work at this love situation and is really concerned about it um, because it's very important to him. All right. Good reading. Let me know how this resonates. It definitely looks like this is going to become love. Uh, however, the masculine might be concerned about it. There is a very good opportunity there for some of you. Could be a workplace, could be healing something, uh, possibly with a past love or with a love right now that you've got a lot of attraction to. And it looks like changes need to happen in order for this love situation to move forward. You may have someone controlling around you as well, but this situation is just going to phase out. All right, let me know how this resonates and what it means to you. And as always, I send you love, peace and light. Bye for now.